And another note you may be curious about this Halloween, when you're out trick-or-treating, you'll see plenty of black and orange, of course, but you may also see teal pumpkins. Fox 51's Olivia Sandusky, she's joining us live in Tyler now to tell us what that means. So, Olivia, what does the color represent? Well, Kara, that's right. If you go trick or treating and you see one of these adorable little teal pumpkins on somebody's front porch, that means the residents will be providing things that are safe for children with allergies. This project actually started in 2014, and the main goal is to include all trick or treaters so kids with allergies don't feel left out. To be a part of the movement, you just have to provide non food treats, have a teal pumpkin, and add your home to the online map. Lindy Britt has a teal pumpkin on her front porch. She's offering allergy safe treats for kids in Tyler. Well, it would be a great way to help with the obesity problem. You know, I kind of feel like it encourages binge eating a little bit. <laughs> as we know, as kids, we like all to eat all the candy when we get home. Um, and then also helping with kids who, you know, can't go to every door trick or treating because they can't have like 90% of the things in their bag. Most families participating hand out small trinkets to find homes like Lindy's in your neighborhood. You can look up the Teal Pumpkin Project map online. I was able to find a handful of homes in East Texas that will be providing allergy safe treats. If you do plan to go trick or treating tonight, remember to check the ingredient list on all candies as well as expiration dates. Reporting live in Tyler, I'm Olivia Sandusky, Fox 51 News.